Today's big question, why do Americans call this jello instead of jelly like the British do? Well, it all has to do with genericization. Genericization is when a branded trademark becomes the general term for something regardless of the brand. This phenomenon often comes about through legal means, but the unpredictability of our language can often lead to the genericization of brands whose trademarks are yet to expire. And this is precisely what happened with jello. After the gelatin dessert originated in ancient 18th century England, food manufacturers began putting their own flavour on it. This included American moustache extraordinaire Pearl Bixby Waite, the founder of Jell-O. During the early 20th century, Waite's version of the jelly became America's go-to dessert. As time went on, Americans started referring to all brands of jelly as Jell-O. And before us Brits start saying things like, ooh, look at those Americans brandifying the language again, we did the same thing with Hoover, Tannoy and Jacuzzi.